So sorry about that. I thought I would get it all in in two and then the camera stopped working. So let's try this again here. Uh, still on uh, 26, they found that the press's responsibility to provide evidence of criminal activity to grand juries is no different from that of any other citizen. That means that any person on the street who sees or gathers uh, criminal evidence or evidence of a crime cannot keep the information confidential or the sources, the, the name of the source confidential. Moving on to 27. Now this is a little bit more. Uh, this is something you absolutely must uh, remember, must know it, must be able to recite it backwards and forwards. Judge Stewart's three-part test, a reporter's privilege to withhold information may exist unless the government can show the following. If the government shows the following three things in this order, they can make you reveal your sources. If none of these or if only two of these apply, they cannot make you reveal your sources. All right, there's probable cause to believe uh, the reporter has information clearly relevant to a specific violation of the law. Okay, so they think that you have information relevant to a crime. That the information sought cannot be obtained by alternative means, meaning you're the only way they can get this information. And number three, that there is a compelling and overriding interest in the information. They have to, the police have to prove that there is um, of an extremely important um, interest in it. Uh, that's the end of this, and I'll post that up there. Please, please remember Justice Stewart's three-part test. It's very important.